I'm Stephanie Carlson. This is our son, Macklin. And I'm Mark Carlson. We're from Denver, Colorado. And we stayed here at Rocky Mountain Hospital for Children when Macklin was a baby, and now he's two. Macklin was born at 41 weeks with esophageal atresia. It was a complete surprise to us, but shortly after we were transferred to Rocky Mountain Hospital, Hospital for Children so that he could receive the care that he needed to have all of that fixed. Esophageal atresia was something I'd never heard of. Basically, Macklin's esophagus wasn't connected properly from his mouth to his stomach. So all of that had to be fixed. And yeah, discovering that whole world, I guess, for us was all new. And coming here was all new. But the staff here made it easy. And the nurses educated us. The doctors educated us. The surgeons fixed him all up. And we had a great experience. Even though it was very, very tough, they made it as easy as it could be. Our experience at Rocky Mountain Hospital for Children was amazing. The first time we got here, I had no idea where to go, who to talk to, what to do. Everything seemed so foreign to me. When we finally got up to the room, all the nurses, staff, doctors were super helpful. It made me calm down. I was getting freaked out. Every little beep I heard, I didn't know what to do. Then by week three, I didn't even care about the beeps and everything was comfortable. I knew where to go, who to talk to and it was a great overall experience. The thing we remember the most is all the people. For sure, I mean, we were here We were here 44 days in the NICU, yeah. and after discharge, we were here at least a couple times a month for follow-up procedures. We haven't had to come for a month or so, though, and we really actually dismissed some of the nurses and staff here at Rocky Mountain Hospital for Children and had to come back and even say hi. Yeah, we're super grateful for all of them. To future patients at Rocky Mountain Hospital for Children and their parents, I mean, just know that you're in really good hands. When we got here, we were super nervous and had no idea what was going to happen, but they took really good care of us, and like I said, we actually miss the staff when we're not here, so they, they are really great here.